room. And he always brightens up our room with that huge smile. He even wakes from his nap with a big smile. He has great stories to share, and he always starts his sentences with, Guess what, teacher Lori? <laughs> you are quite the popular dude in our class with the other children, and have become a leader in our class. I hope you come back to teach us some Spanish you've learned in PSI, and I'll also really miss joking around with you. You have a really good sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> well, Baker is a very busy, happy boy. He's very positive, upbeat, and affectionate. He's good to everyone, and he has a very loving nature. I'll always remember one morning, like late last fall or early in the winter, his mama dropped him off in the morning, like she usually does, and he was gonna go sit down at the table and have some breakfast. And he noticed me kind of standing off to the side, and he comes over to me, and he looks at me and says, Good morning, Debbie. Would you like to give me a hug? <laughs> 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 that's just priceless. That's just why we do what we do. So I do miss his friendliness, and even more when he wakes up from his nap, it's super long to wait and come home. <laughs> <laughs> so we hope we'll be seeing Lincoln if his brother Jackson comes to us. Lincoln, you are such a sweet, kind, and gentle boy. I've enjoyed watching you and your little brother at pickup time. And it's amazing to see how kind and loving you are to him. I don't know if that's the same at home, but it's just incredible to see the two of them at school. I will miss your sense of humor and adorable smile. I will also miss how you always ask me, can I tell you something, Jenny? <laughs> you have made many friends here, and I'm sure you will make many more at PSI. I will definitely miss your hugs. And I will be here in the late afternoon if everyone wants to step by and give me another one. <laughs> or the early morning. Yeah. 